you could, if you have a uh, point and shoot camera, this is a great idea for it. It's called the flip cage. And what the flip cage does is it's a protective cage that protects the camera from damage because it's a completely rubberized um, cage so that the inside is protected. Then it has these flaps. The way the flaps work is this is kind of like a hood man. It keeps the glare off of the uh, screen so when you want to look at the screen you can see it better. It also shows like this which will make a lens shade for your, uh, for your camera. Now, say for example that you know I normally have a case and that case is another part and then I want to take a picture with my friends. Problem is, is I have a case, then I have a little tabletop tripod. That's three different parts. It all combines into one. So a lot of times I want to take a picture, like a group picture with a self-timer. I can stick this right on a table like that, and then I can angle it up or down or whatever, and then just get a bunch of people together, put it on self-timer, and take a picture. Unlike a lot of, uh, actually this is the only tripod that I know of that's of this size, where you can shoot vertical. So I can put it like this and even tilt it upwards and shoot a vertical shot. Here's another position that's really cool. If I flip it around like this and move the doors in like this, it becomes a really cool macro camera. So I can uh, shoot close-ups of, say, jewelry like this, and then I can lower it up and down because there's a little rail on the back that allows me to lower it up and down. And then I can just put my macro, see these flaps right here. You can bring them around and then we can get a couple of flashlights like this and then uh, change the lighting. Use this as like your own portable little macro studio. Flashlights here and we're going to put them on each side and down here we've got a Canon G series and then my watch and then uh, I'll just show you on the back of this guy right here you see you've got a, a little rail so you can slide the camera up and down to get closer to the uh, macro, which is kind of cool. But by moving the flashlight around like that, you can get different uh, qualities of light, and that's kind of cool. If you're shooting videos, this is kind of cool, because you can move it like this, and it becomes a little camcorder, uh, like a steady cam. For tourism, if you're just kind of going around and taking pictures, and you don't want to use just that wrist angle thing, which kind of sucks, because you always wind up banging it into things, we give you this strap. And the strap goes on like that. And uh, if you want to take photos, you just pick up, take your photos, cover it. The camera's completely secure, and it's good to go. It's the uh, flip cage, lots of different colors, Gary Fong flip cage.